What's up guys? So we've arrived here in Cannes, head of the film festival, and we started our trip off at Hotel Majestic with Dior. As you can see behind me, we've got the strip that runs down with all of the stuff that's going on. It's completely buzzing down there to be fair. You can see everybody's walking around. There's even geezers in whistles, which is just crazy because it's actually really hot. But there's a lot going on down here. You can see all the way down the beachfront. Got all loads of temporary stalls, stands, restaurants, so much going on. But we are just about to head to lunch down there or over there, I'm not quite sure. The rest of the guys are currently just sharing Vic and Alex's room to get ready in. Yeah. Girls are doing their thing. This is what it looks like. They brought so much luggage, it's crazy. <laughs> it's actually embarrassing. It's, so, it's so extra. Oh, God. I know. <laughs> Oh, we've just arrived to the Barriere Le Majestic Cannes, Le Plage. There's canapes in the suite, we have a cocktail later, just a nibble like, and then their dinner's at night, so... Amazing. If you do want like a meal now, go for it. Cool. A couple of rude boys sitting in the sun in Cannes, south of France. <laughs> With our strong lids. Strong lids. <laughs> I think that I was expecting Cannes to be more luxurious and less busy, but it's film festival. So disappointed then. I wouldn't say I'm disappointed. The weather's phenomenal. <laughs> I just thought Cannes film festival. I thought there was going to be a big red carpet that went all the way through the street. Carpet, no, the red oh, carpet. Oh, through the street. <laughs> And I thought you. there'd be like lots of men wearing like military uniforms like and like bands and <laughs> stuff. <laughs> Everyone's like, okay. Yeah. <laughs> like a fanfare as soon as you arrive. <laughs> Just like, I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> and like loads of mega yachts. No, it, it, That's Monaco. It's not like old school glamour anymore. It's just right. kind of busy commercial. Yeah. 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 Mm. There we go. <laughs> Steven Seagal made another return. That cheeky little pigeon. <laughs> Trying to get that good stuff. <laughs> Hunting out the rose. <laughs> Come on, mate. He's having a right little bath in there. Like, <laughs> cheeky little fella. <laughs> Comes the money. Oh, oh. <laughs> Yeah, maybe. Yeah, they look like fish and chips. Pomfrits. My salad doesn't look so healthy. Yeah, there's more chips and salad, that's for sure. We've just finished off having lunch, and behind us is the villain from James Bond. James Bond? Blade! Oh, Blade! Blade. Oh, I thought you said James Bond. Yeah. Sorry. Ah, oh, it's not important then. It's not important. Forget that. Forget what I said. We're going to head back to the hotel now. I think Lid and I are going to quickly pop out before this evening. Grab a couple of shots. It's quite busy, so I don't know where we're going to go, but we'll find somewhere, I'm sure. Good luck. And uh, make the most of this sun, because tomorrow it might rain. We've got these random floaty things in the air. I'm trying to work out how they're attached. Now, is this the hotel we're staying in? It is, isn't it? It is. Wow. That's cool, right? So that's your room there, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, 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 that one with the balcony. Didn't Vic Anger Brower on that? No, the other side she did. Yeah. Ladies. <laughs> well, I quite like these little statues. They're cool in the garden. Aren't they? Yeah. I mean, yeah. Certain gardens, for sure. Your garden. <laughs> I'm not sure about my garden. It's the Majestic Hotel. It's good on your front lawn. Yeah, can you imagine? Take up the driveway. <laughs> Right, so we've just come back from lunch and checked into our room, which is absolutely lovely. I don't know if you can see it behind me. We're actually overlooking the Mediterranean. So we're going to go out now and shoot, as I mentioned earlier. Uh, I'm just going to unpack a little bit of my things because I don't know if anybody else has this problem, but when I get to somewhere with my suitcase, it doesn't matter how long I'm staying for, I have to unpack stuff. I have to like organize everything and get it out. I can't just live out a suitcase. Lydia's really good at that, but me personally, I'm like, nope. I need to like organize everything and get everything out and hanging up and sorted. So I'm going to quickly do that now and then we're going to go out. And this is our view from our balcony. Very nice. It's a beautiful day. And then we've got all our luggage. And this is the little TV desk station. Very important for me over here. The bed. And then through here we have our bathroom, which has this amazing 
bathtub, which I would love to just lay in for like 10 hours. Yo. So yeah, it's where we're staying. So we decided to go against going out shooting because we were a bit tight for time. So instead, Lydia has come to have her makeup done ready for this evening's cocktails and dinner, Dior Suite, which is on the sixth floor here at the hotel. So I'm going to go catch up with her now, make sure she's doing okay, and uh, take a look inside the suite with you guys. Let's see what it's all about. <laughs> Then outside here is an amazing balcony. Looks like there's something big going on down there on the red carpet. Wow, look at all those wagons coming in. I've just taken a little stroll down to the harbour. Some horses going past. That's <laughs> right, it's not Lydia. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers, babe. It's okay. And it's actually really peaceful down here. It's like there's some rocks flowing into the water and there's just not so much going on, which means that it's like so much calmer than down the other end where there's just like complete chaos because of all of the celebrities and the red carpets. And I feel like this is what Cannes really is. And I feel like I'm enjoying that part of Cannes. It's like a lot more chilled. You could imagine coming down here in an evening when the sun's setting and just chilling out on the beach. And the beach down here is actually really nice as well. I'll just show you that. One thing I would say is it's very couture. It's very high fashion at the moment. The people here look so glamorous. It looks amazing. Um, but it's just, I think, a bit too chaotic down the bottom end. But up here, it's so nice. Look at this. I think that is what Cannes is all about. So we're currently just chilling in the Dior suite, having some cocktails before we head down to dinner. Um, I thought we were actually going straight to dinner, but evidently we're just chilling in the suite. Everybody's out shooting the sunset. We've got Amelia, Alex shooting on the balcony. Gin and tonics looking rather empty out here. <laughs> So this is a genius idea that every restaurant should have. It's balsamic vinegar and oil. Twinning. That's like a must in every restaurant. It's a two-man effort out here. <laughs> oh, it went out. Welcome to Chateau. I'm glad you finished that one for me, thank you very much. <laughs> Looking lovely. So yeah, and settle down, have some food, and enjoy the afternoon. So much food, can't get through it quick enough. So we just finished off having lunch here at the Dior house, and I think we're just about to grab our cars now back home. This place 
is insane. Like the interior is so luxurious, it's unbelievable. Just finished off having a little exploratory wander around the Perfumist HQ. And uh, we learned a little bit about how they grow wonderful flowers and botanicals and fruits here. The rest of the gang are feeling quite tired, but I'm just starting to wake up today. <laughs> it's like flip reverse. <laughs> <laughs> Energy's coming through. It's the first time I think I've spoken on my blog today. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. So yesterday I was absolutely terrible at blogging, like so bad. I'm normally quite on it, but I feel like I dropped the ball and let the team down. Luckily Lydia's here and she's vlogging as well. Um, so I'm probably gonna steal a couple of clips from her um, to seed in just so when I'm explaining. Uh, what happened yesterday, I can probably showcase a little bit as well. But we started the day off, um, I'm not sure if I picked up the camera when we went to the chateau and the house of Christian Dior, which was just incredible. The interior in that place was insane. Um, I was kind of getting nervous that Lily was gonna redesign our house again. But yeah, it was really nice spending the afternoon there. And then we had like a picnic lunch, kind of picnic lunch. It ended up being a lunch on the table, but um, because of the weather. Uh, but that was just really lovely, kind of like tapas style food, picky bits. And then in the evening, after we had said goodbye to the Dior team, Vic, Alex, Lids and I, we checked in to JW Marriott Hotel for one night, one night only. And last night we went out for dinner with Stephen and Desi Perkins, Alex and Vic. It was pretty funny. Um, we had a few drinks, the drinks were flowing, and it looked a little something like this. I love that everyone has carrying. gone Rina, for the piece of... Oh my God, hi! <laughs> the boys are babies, they're like, it's so cool. <laughs> <It's> cool. <laughs> So yeah, as you can probably see, a little bit worse for weather this morning. Don't feel too rough, but just we had a fair to drink last night, to say the least. A few whiskeys were going. But we're up, packed, ready to check out the hotel because today we're going to be joining L'Oreal and we're going to be staying in the Martinez Hotel. Is that right, Lids? Yeah. Very excited. Apparently it's like the hotel to stay at. All of the big names that are going to be walking the red carpets allegedly will be staying there. So we might see a couple of people, we might not. Uh, but it's also going to be the first time that Lid and I walk the red carpet here in Cannes. So we're both absolutely buzzing for that. I've got my tux with me. Lid has got an amazing dress. Have you told the, the have you told them that the room service people saw your bum this morning? No, I haven't. But you just told them. <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> so yeah, this morning in the hotel I was um just taking five for bollock naked and one of the uh one of the workers here, staff here, I'm not sure what she was, uh, just opened the door and came in, she didn't even knock. And I was just like, oh, hey. Um, and she just went, pardon, pardon, and walked out. And that was that. So I'm guessing she wasn't happy with what she saw and left. <laughs> but anyway, um, I'm gonna stop rambling on. We're gonna head out now and I try and be a little bit better at vlogging today, but we shall see. I'm not promising anything. Calamari to start. Yeah, get that lemon on, boy. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> Is that the squid? Wow, that looks incredible. I've got some beef gaucho. Lydia's, wow, yours looks phenomenal, babe. Wow, fashion. fashion. I hope you've ordered something else with that. Yeah, it's coming. Oh, good. Oh, wow. Oh, there she is. Wow. Perfect. Oh, it's got. Oh, lobster dim sum. Nice. Hey, what's up, guys? So, we just uh, finished off at lunch, which was actually really good. It's probably the best calamari I've ever had. Alex and I were saying it was just the right texture. That was really nice, but we are back at the Martinez. It's crazy here. Like, literally, people just stand outside the front of the hotel for hours because there's so many A-listers and celebrities that I think stay here. It's just insane. But anyway, Liz is below me. <laughs> Doing my makeup. Yes, getting ready. Um, I think the the beauty squid. Squid. <laughs> oh, the beauty dear. squid. Sorry, I've had a couple of beers. The beauty squad are going to be heading over now to do Lydia's makeup for her ahead of this evening's red carpet, of course. So I think I need to kind of get myself ready 
I've just opened my suitcase. It's down on the floor. I need to sort out my camera bag, which is on the bed, ready for this evening because we've been pre-warned. Vic and Alex was like, it's actually really tough to get photos on the red carpet because you're not allowed to take cameras, you're not allowed to take your phones, and it's just chaos. So I think we're gonna hopefully try and get a photo in the hotel before we leave, um, but time is not on our side. So we're gonna do our best. I'm just gonna try and get as prepared as I can ahead of that. So when we do need to do it, I'm ready to go. And then I'll do my best to uh, take you around tonight, but it sounds like it's gonna be pretty hectic. And then at dinner, we can chill. Tonight are uh, ready for the red carpet. This is looking absolutely stunning. And our Kate Halfpenny dress. <laughs> We're just about to head into the L'Oreal room where Liz is gonna have a portrait done. And then we're gonna head out. Vic, give us a 12. Oh yeah! Oh hey! Harrison, give us a 12. No worries, no worries. Right, so we just finished yeah, off on the red too. carpet. Got the guys looking very glamorous behind. Yeah, we don't. And we're now going for dinner. We're hungry. Hi. <laughs> so yeah, he loves it. Come on, get in here. <laughs> oh, I hate it. I hate you're fine. She's fine. How amazing she looks. Anyway, dinner time. Let's feed these hungry bellies. Very miserable here today. We're getting soaked, yeah. but it was well worth it. Just arrived at dinner. Lovely. Wow, you got a lucky escape. here in Cannes has come to an end but what an incredible time it's been last night we went out with the L'Oreal team and had dinner at the Le Mans Beach Club which was Le Mans Plage. yeah which was the um, the same restaurant that we went to with Dior but the Beach Club version it went off like it was crazy just started off all chilled and it just got like louder and louder music we had such a great time and then me lids vic and alex came back to the martinez and had some drinks at the hotel we stayed up till 2 30 a.m so i think we put in a good shift but the trip's been absolutely great and um, we've had such an amazing time with great people so check out the hotel i'm just finishing up doing a couple of edits for lids um, before we head for lunch, we're going to go and meet Leonie and Alex. Um, Okachor, Lydia's just built her rebel over the floor. Nice. <laughs> and then we're going to head back to the hotel because we need to get back home to our cats. And I also go to Paris. I go to France again, actually, um, on Tuesday. So it's all go. Lots of travel at the moment, but it's all very exciting. So I just want to say thank you for watching. I hope you have enjoyed this video. And also a big thank you to Dior and L'Oreal Makeup for letting me come along and join Lydia uh, for the Cannes Film Festival. It's been incredible. And I look forward to seeing you guys on the next one. Peace.